Hello and welcome, my name is Martin. Today we are going to pay tribute to an actor who has been in the business since the early 80s and has appeared in over 100 films to date. He has become a cult figure with his work, his acting skills and with his presence. His name is... Well, he is born as Nicholas Kim Coppola, the nephew of Francis Ford Coppola, the director of The Godfather. But he is better known as Nicholas Cage, who named himself after Marvel superhero Luke Cage. Some fun facts. Nicholas Cage is the owner of the original first Superman comic, Action Comics number one, which he bought at an auction because he is obviously a huge fan. He named his son uh, Kal-El, well, of course, that's Superman's Kryptonian name. He's a big Bruce Lee and Elvis Presley fan. He was once married to Elvis' daughter Priscilla, Priscilla Presley and he is a black belt in Jiu-Jitsu. He loves animals, preferably very weird and deadly animals. For example, he owned a two-headed cobra, which he donated to a zoo because of the concerns of uh, his neighbors. He had two other cobras that danced for him and tried to hypnotize him, only to try to kill him. These snakes were also donated to a zoo. Meanwhile, his team gets rid of any caller who tries to sell an abnormal species to him. There are other stories about Nicolas Cage, but let's get to three Nick Cage movies that are great and cult and that you have to see. It doesn't matter if you are a Nick Cage fan or not. Speaking of massive talent, The Unbearable Weight of Massive Talent is one of Nick's latest films and was the beginning of a very successful Hollywood comeback. At least fans and critics loved it. It was great to see Nicolas Cage back in action and he and Pedro Pascal obviously had a great chemistry together. No spoilers, but let me tell you something about the story. Nicolas Cage plays himself he is struggling in his career and is broke, so he accept, accepts an offer of one million dollars to perform at the birthday party of billionaire Jafe Gutierrez, who is a huge Nick Cage fan. And he is more than he seems. Suddenly the circumstances become very dangerous. Check it out. It's very funny with a lot of well-known actors and some good old Nick Cage action scenes. Whew. Movie number two is one of my favorite movies of all time. It is called Gun in 60 Seconds, starring a young Angelina Jolie and produced by Jerry Bruckheimer. It grossed over $230 million on a budget of $90 million, so it was very successful, the plot. A young car thief works for very dangerous gangsters and agrees to steal 50, 50 high-end cars with his gang. He fails and his clients are not amused and want to kill him in a car crusher. But his older brother Randall Memphis Reigns, Nicolas Cage, a legendary car thief, saves him by agreeing to finish the job. The job. 50 car thefts in 72 hours or his brother will be killed. So he calls up some old buddies and some new ones and starts his shady business. Theft, car chases and lots of action. That is what you get with some of the most beautiful high-end cars you have ever seen, period. Well, and one cursed car you will see. Check it out, it's a great action movie. Ooh, last and least, an action thriller from 1996, directed by Michael Bay, produced by Don Simpson and Jerry Bruckheimer. 
The movie I am talking about is called The Rock, starring the legendary Sean Connery as an old special air service agent. The story. A retired general takes over the former Alcatraz prison and takes hostages. He also stole VX gas rockets, nerf gas, and stationed them all over the island. An attack by the Marines would be, would be too dangerous. So the FBI activates its top chemical weapons specialist, Dr. Stanley Goodspeed. Nicolas Cage and an old SAS special agent who is the only person who has escaped from that prison and knows a secret way in. And of course, they activate a SEAL team. The Rock is action with a great cast of famous actors like Jean Connery, Michael Bean, and Ed Harris, just to name three. The movie grossed $335 million dollars with a budget 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 a budget with a budget of 75 million so it was a huge success and one of my most seen movies oh by the way another great nick cage movie you can find in my video indiana jones alternatives part 2 Check it out. Otherwise, if you know a great Nick Cage movie that should be mentioned, write it down in the comments. Who? that's it. Leave me a like and subscribe. That would be very helpful and kind. Thank you and see you soon here at Binge Watching. Bye. Peace.